Good morning. Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. We're at Luke chapter 16 and today verses 10 through 13. Let's look at this. We're going to finish here on the unjust steward. He who is faithful in what is least is faithful also in much, and he who is unjust in what is least is unjust also in much. Therefore, if you have not been faithful in the unrighteous mammon, who will commit to you your trust the true riches? And if you have not been faithful in what is another man's, who will give you what is your own? No servant can serve two masters, for either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will be loyal to the one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and mammon. So there's the bottom line right there, isn't it? You can't serve God and material stuff. If you're, if that's your plan, I'm going to do both. Okay, I'm going to be a Christian and I'm going to also acquire maximum wealth by any means. That doesn't work. Okay, you cannot. Jesus puts it in plain. So you cannot. It's not possible. It's not going to happen. So you need to have your priorities in order. You need to put God first and everything else is after that. Your own family is after that. God is first always before anything else, right? I hope you understand that value. So we look to that. We, nobody can serve two masters. You need to be completely on God's side or you're going, to be, you're going to be on the devil's side. It's just that simple. Jesus is telling us there is no straddling the line. You can't sit on the fence. It's not going to work. It never works. And so a warning for us there, we cannot serve two. He who is faithful in the least is faithful also in much. It's again, wholeheartedly, I'm determined to be faithful, so I'm going to be faithful even in this little thing, and it's going to turn into faithfulness in big things too. There's a lot more things we could say here, but uh, being faithful about what is another person's, that's important before we're going to receive some of the gifts that God would like to give us. Let's be faithful with other people's stuff, and then we'll be good stewards over the gifts that God gives us. Let's pray. Father in heaven, strange material here in some of these parables, but important for us. Lord, help us to be fully committed to you, or fully on your side, walking with Jesus, Lord, every day. Please, may we uh, give to you our values. May we receive from you the help you have so that we put your kingdom first and everything else is after that. Now, Lord, thank you for hearing our prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Friends, the Lord be with you and be undivided, but put Jesus first, always, every time. His blessings be upon you.